the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And our live game is France against Germany. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Well, thanks for that, Peter. I'm uh, more than ready to get going here. A moment for pride and reflection as players and supporters stand for the national anthems. France proudly line up for their national anthem. Look at the lineups. <laughs> so it's away we go then. Tony Cruz with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Draxler. Hervides. Muller. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. Tweedy. Now it's Paye. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Sanya. Togba gets it back. Is that a foul? Yes, the referee's given it. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Pervides. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what are they trying to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Too long to get the shot away. 
Yeah, he just took too long to make his mind up. You know, what a big opportunity missed then. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Evra. Paye. Matuidi passes it through. Now it's Matuidi. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Yet another dead ball chance. And it's Matuidi. Evra. Looks like a good ball through. Muller. Timely intervention. Matuidi. Conte with the ball through. Paye. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Muller. France so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Draxler, and he has been fouled there. Giroud tries to get it forward quickly. Draxler. but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Pogba. Sanya. Giroud tries a through ball. And the finish! You can get that clear. Sanya drives forward with purpose. Here's the delivery. There's a pattern developing in this game, and the right flank is the productive one. Well, I suppose you could say that, yeah, there's been a more pronounced threat down that side, but how long will they be able to, to avail of it? You know, surely there's going to be a reaction at some stage, and they're going to have to come up with another little solution. Germany, they're going to have to do some adjusting now to try and contain this threat. Someone's going to have to take charge of defensive duties and sort this out. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Griezmann. Now the pass. Tony Kroos. Mesut Ozil. Mats Hummels tries to switch the play, and it's Muller. Paul has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Another throw in. Throw in. Sanya pumps it forwards. Looks to slip it through. Looks like a good ball through. That's well blocked. And back out it comes. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Tried to play it through. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right. But Importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment, and that will pay off. Has a hit! And he's done it! Look, there are always tactical adjustments for any coach to make at half-time, but when your star man gives you a critical lead just before the break, everyone will be paying extra attention. It really is the ideal tonic. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered.
Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. France draw first blood here. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Jerome Boateng. Paye goes for the cross. Griezmann battles to win it back. Firmly met. And the whistle goes for half-time. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. France going to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. France carry a one goal lead into the second half. Hervides plays a clever pass. Wonderful quick feet. Muller with the delivery. Oh, just needed a better contact. And it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. They've come out of the dressing room firing on all cylinders now. We could be in for quite a second half here. Now the pass. Paye has been caught there. It's a foul. Tweedy, Paye, Paye delivers. And he's got his range wrong there. The referee's given a throw. Togba looking to get on the end of this. And that's been repelled. Passes it through. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Mesut Ozil. Hervides. Evra gets it back. Podolski battling down that right flank. Evra concedes a free kick for that. Forward it goes. Muller. Muller with the delivery. And that's not the cross he had in mind. Is it in? This could fall anywhere. Now it's Giroud. Giroud with the ball through. Griezmann delivers a cross. He's dealt with that well. Try from distance. Muller. Now it's Podolski. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Referee has brought play back and shown him a yellow card. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. And it's Matuidi. Now it's Paye. Paye delivers. 
away from immediate danger. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Muller has a look up from the right-hand side, seeking out options. Tweedy has created one goal already. Managed to get it away. Oh, he's caught him there. It's a free kick. Conte tries a long pass towards the front. Taie. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frightened of people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Muller hurtles into the tackle. Evra. Looking up to see who wants it. Taie. Going to find its target. Mesut Ozil is fouled. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Good idea, just poorly executed. Conte was not to be moved. Oh, no question, that's a foul. Conte. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Oh, he's come flying in. Mats Hummels gets into the right position to intercept. Tries a through ball. Mario Goetze looking to get on the end of this. A oh, glorious footwork. Sanya. France just have to run down the clock. Rami does well there. Alert. And it's Podolski. Looks like a good ball through. Hervides passes it through. Conte. Giroud. Jerome Boateng. Muller. And it's Podolski. Hervides. Now the pass. He'll have a dip! Big relief. It just needed better contact. Shows there will be three extra minutes. Out to the left it goes. Giroud with the ball through. And the referee brings it to a close. France, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1 0 the score at the final whistle. Well, you know, it's not easy to hold on to a lead over a long period, but I thought they showed great shape and good discipline to see the whole thing through.